afternoon from a timepiece garden. So yeah, I'm in the garden. Panda's way over there at the edge. Uh, she's looking at me because she's barking. There she is, way over there. Um, she caught them all. Um, very much like the rabbits, she's playing with it. That's what the the um, tree walker, which is a coon hound, that's what it does. It hunts. She found him. She caught him. He's her, he's hers. Um, so yeah, we're not gonna hang out over there. We're gonna talk about the garden. Um, storms broke this morning. Thank God. You can see I've got a great sunny day going on. Well, partly cloudy, but it's a good day to be outside. Um, and as it stands right now, everything that I started as a seedling in the house is in the garden. Um, I got peppers, I got artichokes, I got some lettuces, I got some watermelons and some summer squash, uh, the asparagus, um, some Anaheim peppers, uh, some cucumbers, the tomatoes, um, the other onions that were gifted to me. Um, anyway, everything that was started in the house, uh, the eggplants, everything that was started as a seedling in the house is in the garden. Um, the areas that are still bare like this. Um, that'll be green beans, but that's going to go direct so, and I'm just going to kind of keep going until until I lose the sun. Um, and just fill it in, get the garden rolling, you know? That way I can come back and, um, and start mulching as the plants sprout, you know, the seedlings. Um, I figure I can do some mulching today from all the all the stuff that I got in, you know, that I'd already started in the house, but start mulching it up. Um, just because it does get hot. That was one of the reasons why I picked the garden here. While I do have some shade um, from the trees here, like at high noon, there's a little bit of shade on that half of the garden. Um, sunrise, it's full sun. And up until behind it, until it goes behind the mountain, it's full sun, just like it is now. So, life is good. Um, let me keep going and get busy. Um, got seeds to do, you know? And I'll talk at you later. So those are my roots. I got beets, carrots, carrots, and carrots, uh, parsnips, radishes, radishes, and turnips. I um, did a small row of each, um, just kind of all next to each other. Um, I didn't plant any of these last year because again my garden was so small, I got started so late. And so here we are this year, let's see how they do. Um, see if I got them in the ground too late because they're a cool weather crop. Um, or if I've got them in at the right time. We'll see. And yeah, and we'll just see. And the ones that I like or that do well, we'll plant again as a winter crop and do more of them. Um, but yeah. Um, in case you're wondering, you know, what kind. That's the, the turnip, a white radish, uh, an Easter basket radish, all kinds. Parsnip, a carrot, a carrot, purple on the outside, orange on the inside. It's a carrot, it's an all purple carrot. And then uh, the beets. For the beets, these are supposed to be the less earthy taste of the beets that you can grow. If you've had a beet before, you'll know what I'm saying by earthy taste. Um, Sometimes they can be too earthy for me, so th this will be the first time I'm doing this kind. So we'll see how well I like them or how well I don't like them. And, um, and if not, then we'll just use the greens, you know, cut them up, juice them, whatever. All right, um, on to the next item. See you in a few. All right, tomatoes, a couple of cucumbers. Squash is now in place. Um, and I'm peppers. Gotta love them. The asparagus is there. You can see the starters. And then I went ahead and did a small patch of, um, what are these, glass jam corns. They're really pretty cold. I suppose it's really sweet to eat. Um, we'll find out. And it is still over there, playing with her friend. Let's 
she, it's odd she's not killed it yet. Um, it moves, she picks it up, brings it back into the shade. But she is, she's playing with it. All right, so now we're gonna go into the back row. Um, I'm gonna plant the rest of the strawberries by seed, um, the goji berries, and I've also decided, or I forgot, um, the green beans are right there. Um, I need to do a, another row in front of that of the, um, it's a purple bean um, that I'm trying for the first time. So I've got to put it in too. There you go. It's a purple bean. I'm going to find out. But yeah, they're going to go here to a, a row in front of the green beans because there is enough room for it. Um, yeah, so let me get back to work, and I will talk at you later. All right, so we just finished in the back garden. I'm up front here. I'm getting ready to turn on the hose. Panda is over there. And as soon as I turn on the hose, she'll, uh, she'll come running. Well, maybe not. She looks like she's trying to go back over to the far end. I got your hose! Come on! Here she comes. It's her favorite game. She'll let me get her soaking wet. Wash off the mud because she's been in the mud puddle. She loves a warm day. Go get it. All right, we'll play with my dog. I'll talk to y'all later.